All right, time for a little whistle wedding here. Uh, so this is just a quick thrown together uh, single page editor for one channel. Uh, obviously the uh, final UI will be very different than this. Uh, support all eight channels uh, with all those features, some kind of file browser, etc. for that. Um, this section down here is the uh, QSET editor. Um, so let's go ahead and load up uh, one of the sample files that I currently have. Um, you can see that uh, we read in, this is uh, from the set of test files that's for the filter type. So we loaded the one that uh, had the notch filter selected. Let's go ahead and load one that has the uh, band pass selected. See that gets to band pass. So uh, yeah, uh, so I'm reading most of the data incorrectly. Some of it I need to scale differently um, for the display and how it's stored, but otherwise good. Um, this is the section that will be for editing your cues um, with a start, loop and end edit markers. Uh, those just look like they do because that's how I had them for the assimilator editor. Um, but uh, since we have 64 cue sets, I figure we'll do 32 tabs on the top and the bottom here. And therefore you can select one of those and edit the cue from that cue set. And that's it, it's coming along. Uh, don't wanna get everyone's hopes up too much because I don't know, you know, uh, how long all the pieces will take to get together, but starting to make some good progress now that I'm focused on it, so yay.